वेलकम बैक टू मई यूट्यूब चानल फ्रम एजी एस टेक् इफ यू आर् न्यू इन अवर् चानल सब्सक्रेब अवर् चानल अंड क्लिक बेल इफ यू क्लिक बेल यू विल गेट नोटिफिकेशन फ्रम न्यू वीडियो अपडेशन टूडे वी गोइंग टू सी हाउ टू इंपोर्ट Excel to tally inventory and ledger first we enable the customization and how it will working process we will show first we go to data of tally data of tally first we enable the customization we go to f11 add on feature import purchase voucher inventory with ledgers you can select yes then finally accept then go go to gate of tally here the one menu it will show per purchase import you can select purchase import here it will ask import file name which file name we want to import you need to give full path of the excel sheet and name also including name then you can select voucher type which voucher type we want to insert the transaction excel data this is screen of the import purchase information we will show excel sheet this is our excel sheet first column voucher number second column date another another column invoice number and next column invoice date next column is party ledger and next column ledger name and accounting ledger then stock item name then quantity then rate then discount column then amount column finally narration column this columns are available in purchase inventory plus ledger details first row we will show first row voucher number is then voucher date supplier reference number supplier reference date if, if it is party ledger you can give here yes then select party ledger name abc limited then we go to accounting ledger accounting ledger is accounting allocation ledger common accounting allocation ledger if you give your ledger allocation detail then stock item name then quantity rate discount amount and this is voucher narration which your data you need to information you can give here voucher narration then go to fifth row fifth row then we added freight ledger freight ledger this is ledger information freight ledger then you don't need to give any information of accounting ledger and stock item we direct come to amount field amount field whichever amount you will give that will import in tally and goods and service tax ledger central gst and state gst ledgers here also same thing you can give direct amount here how much amount it will come it, you can give that then we will show how to import first we attach the excel sheet and save the excel sheet all ledgers are already created in tally itself we are not create any ledgers stock items if it will 
available in tally it will be import otherwise it will come error that particular ledger or particular stock item does not exist in tally rp9 then we go to file path where is file path is available we select full path of the file name book1.xls i select book1.xls shift home control c then i go to purchase import menu and i will paste control alt v paste then you can select ledger you can select voucher type which voucher type you want i can select demo purchase then i will save the transaction it will be imported successfully in excel to tally we will show that display demo and then what transaction is available where is it whichever excel data the excel data is inserted successfully voucher number one voucher date supplier invoice number supplier invoice date voucher number one voucher date voucher date 1 october and supplier invoice number five supplier invoice number five invoice date supply reference date supply reference date then party ledger abc limited a party accounting name abc limited then purchase ledger accounting ledger purchase account ledger then stock item name it will come stock item name iphone x iphone x and quantity 100 quantity quantity 100 and rate of 70,000 rate 70,000 and discount provided 10 percentage in excel also discount 10 percentage and amount 635 times 0 635 times 0 correct right. then iphone 8 will check next iphone 8 50 quantity purchase order 50 quantity rate of 50,000 50 quantity rate of 50,000 iphone 8 50 quantity rate of 50,000 and 5 percentage discount and total value 23753 times 0 23753 times 0 then iPhone 7 10 pieces 35,000 rupees just like iPhone 7 10 pieces 35,000 and discount 10 discount 10 and 31500 then freight charges our ledger information freight charges then freight amount freight amount then central goods and service tax central goods and service tax and service ledger amount a state goods and service tax state goods and service tax amount then finally will allocation and test narration here we will give one which narration that will be inserted in tally rp9 then we added one more line to 1 11 20 20 6 31 2020 party ledger is ABC limited purchase account that purchase iPhone X iPhone X one quantity seventy thousand 
without discount so only closing this narration okay then I can add Entry also in tally. We have one thing, one entry available in tally. We enter we another one Excel detail. Watch number two date one eleven and party ABC limited say purchase life one X. Rate quantity one rate of seventy thousand no discount and CST good stacks then we enter this also go to tally purchase input select the excel name only enter it will be enter the my function message is coming voucher number one already exists the voucher number is one already exists that only it will not end repeated time only one time it will be entered then we will show period one one Whichever entry we enter, watch number 2, November, supply invoice in the supply date ABC and purchase information and inventory transaction details and central GST straight with GST information and finally we get narration also. Let's save it. Thank you friends. If you like this video, please like, share with your friends. If you are in new in our channel, subscribe our channel. If you want customization, please contact us. Mobile number 9384128300. Email ID agstechh at gmail.com. Thank you for watching our channel. If you want customization file, you command your mail ID or WhatsApp number. We will send through mail or WhatsApp demo file. Thank you for watching our channel. If you like video, please share with your friends. Thank you friends.